So a 15 plat against a rank one. Platinum. <laughs> so he really wanted them dead. So down in the bottom we have Jen. And in the upper part of Ohana we have Sibon. Keep on held that camera myself quite well, I must say. So we'll soon see what the openings are and the pile on going in the back for Seabone. That's interesting. So it does what? put it near its nexus. But mm. in the back of his mineral line. Hmm. Interesting. Maybe trying to cannon rush secretly? I don't know. I've never Wait seen I've never seen that tactic. <laughs> okay, it's the Is weird Palon placement. Jen is, oh, Jen is looking for proxies, okay. Yeah. Jen's thinking uh, something's up again. Because he didn't see the pylon. But he's putting his uh, gateways on the back of his base, hmm. which is kind of weird, I must say. And we have a gas coming up. So I'm sure Jen, um, I don't know whether he saw that gateway or not, because he did stop. Let's see what Jen sees on his vision. So yes, Jen did, did see it, did see the gateway, so he knows there's not going to be any kind of proxy. So Jen did see it. He was worried there for a second though, and I'll blame him. Yeah. We have a gateway down, and a cyber cord coming down for Jen, and a cyber cord going down for Seabon. I, I'm not really sure about this opening though. Why would you want to put yourself in the back of your mineral line? I've never seen know. that. What's uh, up, Steve? I've never ever seen that. Hmm. Okay. I ain't platinum, so. <laughs> but so far, maybe I ever going to see a full gate from, C uh, from Jen because he hasn't gone to a second gas yet. I'm thinking maybe four gate. Possible, or is he just getting his gas late? I don't know what's going on. Okay, so we have Seep on here. He's got a probe going back and forth there. I don't know if C if Jen saw <coughs> it, but the probe did scare him out. I'll be right back. I need some water. The probe doesn't do anything though. We have a forge down, so he definitely could have placed cannons. So what is he going to do? Hmm. Wow, it's interesting. Why is the probe going way over here? Okay, I'm not sure what Seabon is doing right now. There is a definite possible four gate happening. Definitely could see that right now. Jen has got his three extra gateways. Um, he did have a. Uh, uh, he has a proxy already laid out, and uh, so does Seabon. Seabon has a proxy as well. So, and we have a cannon here in the front, so that should possibly hold the foregate, maybe. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Uh, we do have another gateway, and we have a dark shrine. Oh, we're going to see some DT's action here from Seabon. Wow, so DT Shrine. That's why he won cannons. Okay. I was going to say, why would you go cannons? But, um, Jen doesn't know that yet. And when he gets warp, he's going to be up to warp for DT. Because uh, Jen has no detection, no robo. No forge, no nothing. So, if he just, uh, if he can get past this cannon, 
He needs to focus it down somehow. So we have two more additional gates coming up. This could be dangerous. That uh, DT is all, shrine is almost done. We are one second and it's done. So now we have DTs can be warped in at any time right now. Uh, we do have uh, Seabon coming in again. Seeing what's going on. Uh, now Forge is being laid for Jan, but this could be too late because we have two, T two DTs coming in right now. So yeah, this is this is way too late. Uh, those CTs are just going to go to town right now, and that's going to be the end of those probes. Uh, no detection. Uh, he does try to move the the probes away. Uh, the DTs are going after, no. Uh, will they go after the forge? No, it won't. Uh, also, Jen uh, has some suckers there. <clears throat> now, is he able to get a photon cannon up in time? That's going to be the question. Uh, these DTs are just going to go down and Jen calls the GG. So DTs won it. 